Okay, so I want to show you another way that you can add um, <clears throat> some interesting things to your image. Um, I've decided, I've started off by painting this whole background flat white and I did two coats. And I could leave it that way if I wanted to, but I, I want to also show you some new and different things that you can do with it as well. So I'm going to take just some masking tape and tape back off those edges as neatly as I can and really rub to make sure that that's attached. Now, if you don't have masking tape, you could really use a lot of different kinds of tape. Um, scotch tape will work as well if you've got clear kind of gift wrapping tape. Washi tape will also work, the paper brand, the paper style of tape. Lots of, lots of different things. I probably wouldn't use anything like duct tape because that probably has too much adhesive in it. It might mess up your fabric, but any of these sort of low tack, um, not super sticky tapes like this should work. And what I've decided to show you is how if you are interested, you can create an ombre effect. What I'm gonna do is just take a navy blue paint and then some white craft paint and I am going to do sort of a color ombre fade and I wanna show you how to do that really quick. So with a wet brush, and remember, I don't wanna brush underneath my tape, I wanna brush alongside it um, or away from it. So I'm gonna start down here at the bottom, brushing away in that side and then away on this side. Okay, so I've got some blue laid in and now I'm gonna to start to introduce some white. Now, and as I go up, this first layer looks pretty rough. It's not super smooth transitions, but as I go up, I'll um, gradually keep adding more white. I'm gonna rinse out my brush now to get out most of the blue and work with just white. And I'll be able to go back in and do a second and possibly third coat until I really get this to where I'm very happy with the transitions. But it does take a while to sort of build up the color and get it to blend the way that you want. If your paint is drying too quickly, you can add just a little touch of water to it to thin it down. And just really keep working that paint kind of back and forth. Okay, and so now I'm gonna let this dry and then I'll come back and I'll start a second coat. And once I have the second coat done, you'll see that ombre starts to come out and look a lot better.